Hey everybody, welcome back. Trailer reaction time. And today we've got a blind trailer. I think, actually it's not that blind. I'm mostly going in blind. I just realized what I'm about to watch. Today we're here to watch the teaser trailer for Spencer. Maybe it's not what I think it is. I don't know. If you want to see this trailer without my confused face in the way, there's a link in the description below or something's popping up right about now. You can click on that, check it out. Come on back, watch me watch this, and then we'll geek out of it together should it be geek out worthy. Sorry, I'm working on a delicious Oktoberfest over there, and I thought it was about to be a big old belch, and it wasn't, luckily. All right, uh, remember, though, the world is crazy, times are tough, things are strange when you're a stranger or even when you're not. But I'd like to remind you that we will get through this. We will get through this together. And you can say that with me. We'll do that daily positivity, that mantra thing we like to do. We will get through this. We We'll get through this together. Cool. I feel better, don't you? All right, so if this is what I think it is, is it uh, Christian Stewart as Princess Di? Is that a thing? Did I dream that? Why would I want to dream that? I never cared about Princess Di. Listen, before we jump in here, I just, I'm just i going to I'm gonna rant just a brief second. Um, I don't get it. I'm not judging it. Well, I guess I am kind of judging it, but I'm not judging it. I'm just expressing... I'm not judging it. I'm just expressing my feeling about this. I've never understood Americans' fascination with, like, the British royal family. Like, we're, we're Americans. We're, we don't necessarily have to hate them, but we, we really should not be, like, applauding kings and queens and princesses and stuff. I don't understand it. Princess Di, I kind of understand, was a different story because of her, her humanitarian work, but I don't understand people's, like, just absolute fascination with, like, Queen Elizabeth and stuff. It's like, F her, man. Um, if you're a UK watcher and you love it, hey, sorry, I'm, I, I, you're fine. <laughs> I get it if you are, but you know, I don't know. Anyways, whatever. All right, I've said too much. I have nothing else to say about this. You're probably, uh, who cares? Let's just watch. This is why I YouTube for fun. Sorry, it's a teaser trailer. It's short. Um, I got thoughts. I should also clarify that even if though I'm not fascinated in the uh, British monarchy, um, and I can make the other side panicky. Uh, 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 I mean, a good movie is a good movie, so I might be interested in that. And again, it's more about Princess Diana. Two things come to mind. One, it's weird how that felt like a horror film, but knowing you know what happens in her life, okay, kind of makes sense. They treat it a little bit like a horror film tonally. Uh, two. Why does it have that weird, are they going for that like BBC film TV look? Because it has that slight blurriness to it we don't get in like modern cinema. Um, that slight bloomy, blown out highlights kind of thing as well in the brights on the on the visuals. That was just kind of weird. Um, I thought maybe my internet was going crap and it was going down to like standard definition, but then titles would come up and they were like crystal HD clear. So I don't know, weird. Uh, and then I will also say a third thing. It's from the director of Jackie. I never got around to seeing that. I really wanted to. I really need to, especially with my love of Natalie Portman. And uh, I know it was a fabulous movie from all accounts, basically. So it's a great director in great hands. I might give that a shot. I can't say that that's something I'm terribly excited for. I'd be excited for Kristen Stewart because, again, she's one of those actors like a Robert Pattinson. Listen, get over the Twilight stuff, people, all right? And if you like Twilight, you like Twilight, that's fine. I'm not going to crap on you for that. I'm not judging. Movies are terribly subjective. It, there is no wrong or right in what's good or bad, um, except to your own experience. But, um, but like, get over the Twilight stuff because these are phenomenal actors. Kristen Stewart is amazing. She's done some incredible stuff uh, throughout her career. And uh, I think, you know, if you're still hung up on that, you really need to get over it. 
and give her a chance because I think she'll be fantastic in that. I, I have a feeling Kristen Stewart might actually win an Oscar at some point in her career. Uh, this might be a stepping stone. I don't know if that's good enough for nominations, but maybe. Uh, she's very transformative in that, so cool. All right, well, how do you all feel about it, though? Does that look good to you? Are you one of those Americans obsessed with the uh, British people? Let me know. And again, feel free to politely explain what your fascination is, <laughs> you know? I mean, I'm always up to learn about other people's experiences. And with new information, like a smart person would, I can change my mind. It's, I know it's, it's a weird concept to some of you out there, but you, you learn new things, you have new perspectives. But let me know. Geek out with me in the comments. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Other than that, click the thumbs up button. Give me the good old thumb of encouragement, as do love to be encouraged. Remember that we will get through this. We will get through this together. And then, of course, check out my music everywhere music is. Just look up Eric Butts on all your streaming sites or come to my main YouTube page. Right now, I'm doing like a whole pop punk thing for this new album. Really excited about what's already out there. There's eight songs of it out there, eight more to go. I'm working on those now. They'll be out soon. And, uh, you know, you want to get it first before anybody else. There's a band camp link. You want to hear the history, some of these original songs I'm redoing, the history of my filmmaking, my life in general. We're doing that on Patreon. Very inexpensive if you want to help support me. Another great way to support this channel and me if you want financially or whatever, buy us some cheese for our grilled cheese videos and then you can watch them as well, is to do the memberships. Uh, there's a join button next to subscribe or a join link in the description below. And for various prices, you'll get various amounts of videos every week where we do video game Let's Plays. Mary does some of those with me. Uh, cooking videos, beer taste tests, all kinds of crazy stuff like that. Disney Plus show reviews and more, so you can check all that out. Because there's a lot of stuff down in that description, so click that see more button to see more butts. All right, that's said and done. I'm done ranting about things for now. I'm going to get out of here so I can go watch some more stuff, and I'll see you all later.